Hi, my name is Alexander Moore, founder and CEO of Yumi Care, a digital marketplace connecting seniors to trained local caregivers. So this is my mom, dad, and grandmother Gigi. She's 97 years young, and she's always been very active and independent. That is, until a couple of years ago when she started needing more help with daily care. She started doing some forgetful things, and we started to get worried. So we knew that she did not want to go into an assisted living facility or nursing home, so we started to look at home care as an option. But we didn't like what we found. We found burned out caregivers, and it was a new caregiver every week, which wasn't good for consistency. And they would do things for my grandmother, but they didn't do things with my grandmother. And so she started to see her independence slip. And she felt a little bit like a child, and she felt like she didn't have a choice in what was going on. So my parents decided to move in with her. And they did it because they felt like they didn't have a choice about what was going on. And they're part of a growing demographic of people who are responsible for taking care of aging seniors in their home. And they're put in this position because there's a shortage of qualified caregivers to help seniors remain active and independent in the place that they want to be. But what if they were wrong? What if there was an option? What if there was a professional caregiver who could come in and quickly establish a supportive relationship and help people remain active and independent no matter their age or ability? Meet the Yumi caregiver. The Yumi caregiver is a professional caregiver who focuses on independence by helping support connectivity, safety, and physical activity. They're a professional caregiver who enjoys 60% higher wages than the average caregiver. They enjoy next day pay and flexible scheduling. We are totally solving the caregiver crisis by making caregiving the attractive and rewarding career that it should be. While we were under the hood, we totally revamped the customer experience to stop focusing on just getting someone there to help, we wanted to focus on getting the right person there at the right time to support the unique needs of our clients and the unique personalities of our clients. So we're able to take things into consideration like personality when we're doing this match so that the relationship has its best chance of getting off the ground on the right foot. And we do this through a managed marketplace where we do guided onboarding that allows us to build a detailed profile, and then we use that profile to match them with our caregivers, and then we have tools to help manage the day-to-day -day billing, scheduling, and communication that you need to have in order to have a household worker. Our caregivers can help support all the things that you or me would do for our family if we were supporting them, so companionship, personal care, medication reminders. And I'm happy to say that we're off to a great start. We started our pilot in November of last year. And if you're a caregiver in the US, you know that the retention rate of caregivers in the US is just not very good. It's about 35%. We've been able to maintain a 77% retention rate of our active caregivers, and that number is going to go up from here because we're creating a culture around the art of caring. We've also started to change the lives of our clients. I want you to meet Doris and Alfreda, Doris has been going to the neurologist for the last three years, and her scores have been slipping with memory care issues. And so her daughter started to get concerned, and she finally took action, and she called us. And we were able to match her with Alfreda, and the two were fast friends. Alfreda comes over just a couple hours a day, several days a week, but the impact has been miraculous. For the first time in three years, Doris's scores are actually going up. There are 10,000 people turning 65 every day for the next 30 years. And the in-home caregiving market alone is worth $30 billion, and that number is going to explode over the next 30 years. We're just getting started. My team is the team to make it happen. I've been in healthcare for 20 years, changing things from the inside out, and my co-founder has a degree in computer science and engineering, and we're the perfect team to make this happen. And I want to make an offer to everyone in the audience today, that if you have somebody in your life like Gigi and you're navigating this uh, difficult journey, reach out. Even if you're not in our service area, we are happy to provide a consultation to help you through this difficult time. Our vision is for YumiCare to be a household name for aging in place so that people like Gigi can age gracefully on their own terms. Thank you. <laughs>